Something I'm really passionate about, it is asking strangers on the street if you can stay at their place. I'll give you now a couple of tips how to do it. Basically, really, it's all about just walking up to a random person on the street, or it doesn't have to be on the street, it can be really anywhere, and ask this person if you can stay at their home. You can do it as simple as just walking up and being like, hey, I'm a traveler, can I stay at your place? That's what you have to do, that's basically it. But there are a couple of tips, a couple of things maybe to keep in mind to help you um, with this. Um, uh, to start off, if, if you never heard of this before, if, uh, it might sound scary to you, but there's hope. To me, it was also scary at first when I tried it out when I was doing my first travel. You can get used to it though, like I, I highly recommend you to maybe challenge yourself to make it a habit to ask strangers on the street. <clears throat> doesn't even have to be for a place to stay, but just ask for the time. Then push your comfort zone, ask people for the direction, ask people for whatever, and then kind of learn to gradually be there at, a, at a point where you can just really comfortably ask somebody if you can stay at the home. Um, yeah, that's my little advice for this. It, I, you can do it, seriously. It might be difficult and everything, but uh, try it and I, I believe in you, you can do it. Okay, now we talk about locations. First of all, locations, where can you go to, to find those people? So very obvious now, just the street, <laughs> um, pedest like pedestrians. Um, where I love to go to is universities, uh, one of the best places really to do this. Um, also, what I like to do is just ask around for like a place where young people meet. Doesn't necessarily have to be a university, but just maybe a cafe, some some nice cool place. Sometimes they even walk around and ask people if they know a place where I can find cool people and then I would go to this very location. So then what people would I walk up to and ask this? I, I myself, I would aim for people that are my age or, or, or around my age. So people that are going to university, that are in their 20s. And what I usually look for are people that look cool what so maybe you ask yourself what are cool people how do they look like i think everybody has their own definition of this i have my own vision kind of of this the couple of people i, I walk around i'm just like wow this guy is cool and when i see those people or when you see those people i recommend you walk up to those people tell them hey i think you're, you're really cool um and now um yeah we're also talking about this uh, about it um when you're talking to somebody you can do something like you just right away ask, hey, can I have a place to stay? This actually works. Yes, I did it before and it actually works. You can also find people like this. Um, it's, sometimes you can find people that look really friendly and you're just like, yeah, totally, this person will say yes. But what I can recommend you, be in a conversation with this person and have already a connection. I really recommend you, before you ask for a place to stay, try to establish some kind of connection with this person. And what might also happen is that you'll find people with which you don't have the connection and then just don't ask for a place to stay. Uh, but I can just highly, highly recommend you to ask around a lot of people. Don't just ask one person. What I was used to do, lo what I was used to do like back in the days, like two years ago, I was used to go to university or universities and then for like one, two, three hours, walk up to every person basically and just ask, hey, can I stay at your place? No, can I stay at your place? No. Do it quick, you know, do it with many people but also try to establish a connection first. And and maybe you think this, what happens to me a lot of times, actually that sometimes I think that people are just kind of boring. I don't even want to stay at the place of this person, so then I don't ask. And then I just walk up to another group of people and, and I ask them if I can stay at their place. Yeah, and you'll get, we would also wrote as a note here, you will get a sense, you will get some, you'll get a sense of what kind of people you can approach and which people it works um, better than or than with others. That's something you can kind of learn. It's a skill you can really learn actually, which people will probably help you to get a place to stay. Um, yeah, you get like a a sixth sense to find out how, how, how you can do this. So you can learn. Okay, in the next lesson, okay, thank you for, watch for, thank you for watching this lesson. Up next, I will talk about uh, camping. Yes.